Hello everybody, this is Dr. Bob DiMaria with another episode of Ask Dr. Bob. We thoroughly enjoy the questions and people are coming to see us from all over the world and they're asking us questions and we thoroughly enjoy helping you. We can also talk to you via Skype and or uh, FaceTime. Dr. Bob, what helps the most to bring down estrogen, the bad kind, is it progesterone cream or foods? The best is broccoli. Broccoli is an excellent aromatase inhibitor. So progesterone balances estrogen, but if you want to lower estrogen, probably the best food is broccoli and sulfur-based foods, but you also want your liver to be functioning optimally because your liver clears estrogen. Excellent question. What are the best prenatal vitamins before getting pregnant? That was a key question. It's before getting pregnant. You might want to prepare to get pregnant for six months, but not only do you want prenatal vitamins, which we use, the Biotics Corporation, which we have found to be excellent, and we test everybody for them, is you want to make sure you have enough iodine, B12, and oil. Now, if you really want to take this serious, contact us and let us do a CBC with a differential to make sure you have enough of the factors that we know you have enough B12. We want to make sure your thyroid glands at 100%. We do that by looking at T4. You may even consider a urine iodine loading test. Every day in our practice, we have ladies that have tried to get pregnant, couldn't get pregnant. We help them get pregnant just by helping them get optimal function and optimal nutrients. Excellent question. Is black currant seed oil good for you? And is it safe? And they're going to try it for some of their own health issues. We use black currant seed oil in our practice. It's an excellent, excellent, excellent source of omega-3, 6, and 9 fats. 9 usually comes from an olive oil and or avocado. The black currant seed oil is not fish. It's not flax. It's black currant seed oil. And we do have good, very good results. Actually, we do a lot of essential fatty acid blood spot tests. And that helps us determine the exact oils your body may need. How would, hi, would you mind telling me how I can get rid of stretch marks? Well, when my wife was pregnant many, many years ago, she used coconut butter on her abdomen. You can put coconut butter on your abdomen. You can put it on your breast. You may consider doing lanolin, but you want to make sure it's organic. Whatever you put on your body, you want it to be as without chemicals or any kind of toxic nutrients. Last question. What are the practical solutions if your heel hurt? It's on the right foot, lower side. So heel pain can be caused from a lot of different reasons. It could be fasciitis. So we know that people who are alkaline tend to have fasciitis. You may need a product that we use is B6 phosphate and or bio CMP. I actually use bio CMP for my shoulder. It's a source of calcium, magnesium, and potassium. And you may even think about getting a cup or two of Epsom salts in a little basin. You put your feet in it, soaking. The Epsom salts will help draw the swelling and the inflammation out of your body. Some very good questions, and I know this will make a difference in someone's life. I'm Dr. Bob DeMarie.